Welcome to Play and Catch. If you're here, it's because this was your choice for your PE activity this week. You're going to need a few things to get started. First, you're going to need four socks. You're going to take those socks and put them together into a pair. You'll need two pairs of socks. Off today's lesson with some individual challenges. We're going to be practicing tossing and catching by yourselves. I'll give you a challenge. We're going to start off easy. You're going to hit pause. You're going to do that challenge for as long as you need to. When you're ready to step it up, you'll hit play. I'll show you what the next one is. You'll pause it and practice that one for as long as you need to. After we get through all of our individual challenges, then you're going to need to get a partner. So you're going to have to get someone in your family or in your household to help you out. We're going to practice tossing and catching with them, and then we're going to do overhand throwing with them. That'll be our lesson. We are doing this lesson with a ball of socks to be safe inside our home. If you have another soft ball that you can use, that's okay. And if you can go outside, you can choose your equipment too. All right, let's go. All right, now as we go through these challenges, you're going to pause your computer and you're going to practice those challenges for as long as you need to. And when you're ready, you're going to hit play and see what the next challenge is. Starting off easy, we're going to go two-hand toss to a two-hand catch. We always want to imagine that the ball is like an egg. You want to have soft hands so you don't break the egg. You're going to use your main hand now. So you want to reach out for the ball and then you want to bring it in with soft hands. Don't break that egg. You're using your main hand now. Now you're going to use your other hand. Your other hand is probably going to be a little tougher. But if you keep your eye on it and you use soft hands, you should catch it. If you want to go a little higher, you can get on your knees or on your bottom, and then you can toss it a little higher. Now, you're going to go from your left to your right, back and forth, back and forth. If you want to make it a little more challenging, you can catch it a little lower, right? Or try to go a little faster, left to your right. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to toss it up, and I'm going to turn my body a quarter and catch it. Ready? I'm going to toss it, quarter. I'm going to toss it, quarter. So I'm cat tossing it and catching it by spinning. Now, I'm going to try to do a 180. So I'm going to turn. Oh, that was a 360. I'm going to do it again. Ready? 180. 180. Now, we're going to try a 360. Ready? This is going to be tougher. A 360 turn. Your next challenge is to toss it up, touch the floor, Stand up and catch it. Ready? Two in. All right. Next one. You are going to sit down, toss it up, stand up and catch it. Ready? Oh, I missed that one. How about you're going to toss it up, sit down and catch it. After you. Oh, I barely got it. It's like that. I'll go one more. Ah, this time you're gonna toss it and move to catch. Ready? This time you're gonna toss it up and you're gonna see if you can clap one time. Two, three, four, five. Six. Ah, I don't know if I got six. See how many claps you can get. This time, we're going to jump up and catch. Ready? Can you do a heel click and catch? This time, you're going to lie down. This is Reese. You're going to lie down, toss it up, and catch it. Ready? Toss it up to yourself. Catch it. Catch it. If that's easy for you, try with one hand. Reese, other hand, one hand, other hand. You're going to toss it up, jump up, and catch it. Now, we're going to use our body parts to help us catch. We're going to put that on, a, on the back of our hand. We're going to toss it up and catch it. It's like this. Toss it up, catch it. Other hand, toss it up with the back of your hand, catch it. Now, we're going to move to our elbow, our chicken wing. Ready? Flap that wing, catch it. Flap that wing, catch it. How about put it on your knee? 
for your foot. Put it on your foot, toss it up, catch it. How about the other one? Put it on your foot, toss it up, catch it. How about on top of your head? You're going to jump up and catch it. Now we're going to get really challenging. You're going to take this, this ball, you're going to pass it down to your foot, kick it up to yourself. How about the other one? Kick it up to yourself. Now, can you toss it up and catch it on a body part? Ready? I'm going to toss it up and land it on the back of my hand. I'm going to toss it up and land it on my elbow, really on my arm. I'm now going to toss it up and try to land it on my back. Ready? There it is on my back. And now I'm going to kick it off and catch it with my hands. Try those. The last challenge I have for you is with two pairs of socks. Now, can you toss them both up at the same time and catch them both? Much harder because you have to keep your eye on two different things. Can you switch them in the air? That's even harder. Like you're juggling. That's all the challenges that I have for you by yourself. Now you're going to need to get a partner. So ask a family member if they have some time to practice with you. So you've made it through individual tosses and catches. Now you're going to find a family member to play catch with you. This is my wife, Alicia. She's going to be my partner today. So Alicia, we're going to start off with underhand tosses and catches. So here's what you're going to do. You're going to put your pinkies together just like this. Just like this. All right, if, the, if the ball or the socks are underneath your belly button, you're going to have your pinkies together. Now, if it's above your belly button, you're going to put your thumbs together. See, that? that's how you're going to catch it. Are you ready? We always step with the opposite foot. You're going to swing on back and then forward. Ready? Nice and easy, just like that. Now, a few challenges that we can do with this. How many catches can we make in a row? There's three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Now, another thing you can do with this is start off really close. Let's meet in the middle, right? And every time you catch it, you can scoot back. Good. Now, I, we both take a step back. We were pretty good at that. So the next thing we're going to do is add a second pair of socks. Alicia, take those. We're going to start just like this. We're going to toss it at the same time. You want to have a cue. Our cue is going to be ready, set, go. Ready, set, go. And we're going to switch. Every time we do it, we can take a step back. Ready, set, go. Ready, set, go. Ready, set, go. Ready, set, go. So a few challenges. How many can you catch in a row? How far can you get apart? And then you could set a timer, maybe 30 seconds or a minute. How many catches can you do in that amount of time? Now, if you have a space that you can go outside, you can get much further, and then it becomes much more challenging. Now, we're going to step it up to overhand throwing. When we throw overhanded, we still always step with the opposite foot. Now, our cues are T, L, step, and throw. That's what it's going to look like. But you do not need to stop at each point. That's just what it, the motion looks like. It's a T, an L, a step, and throw. Alicia, you ready? Give me a target. Always give your partner a target. Her, th her thumbs are going to be together. I want to hit her right in those hands. So I'm going to start off right here. I'm going to do my T, L, step, throw, and I'm a nice and easy toss it to her. Come on back to me. Perfect. Ready. T, L, step. Every time you catch it, you can scoot back. Again, if you have a spot to go outside, you can get much farther, and it becomes much more challenging. You can see how many you all catch in a row, and you can see how many you catch in a given amount of time. If you want to make it more challenging for catching, you can try to catch with one hand. Alicia, which hand do you want to catch with? All right. And I'm going to try to hit her in that hand. Awesome. Perfect. Now try your other hand. Good. When catching, you want to put your hands out, give a good target, and when the ball comes to you, you want to give with it and bring it to your chest. Awesome job, Alicia. So if you're able to go outside, it can be much more challenging because you can get farther apart and it can be much more fun. Every time we catch it, we're going to take a big step back, and if we drop it, we have to come all the way back to the start. Ready? Okay, remember, opposite foot, TL step throw. Nice. Always give a target. 
Oh, so that went over my head. We got to go all the way back to the start. And the thing about coming outside too is you can use different types of balls. So now we're going to try it with a football. Ready? With a football, you don't have to make the T L step throw. You come straight to the L step throw. That ball goes to your ear. L step throw. Ready, Alicia? Thank you for giving me that target. Oh, here we go. There we go. Scoot over just a little bit. The tree's in my way. All right. Yeah, go back real far this time. Let's see, let's see what she's got, you all. Ah, ah, and we got to go back to the start. All right, you all. That is the end of our lesson. I hope you had a blast. And I know you got better at tossing, throwing, and catching. Remember, the main points about today's lesson were always step with the opposite foot. When throwing, we pointed our target with a T, L, step, and throw. With a football, we pointed our target with an L, step, and throw. When catching, we always give a target. When it's above our belly button, thumbs together. When it's below, pinkies together. We give that target out here, and as the ball comes to us, we catch it, bringing it to our bodies with soft hands. We don't want to break the egg. Now that you're done, you're going to go back to our Google Slides, and you're going to click on the Google Form link and fill that out for me. Awesome job, you all. See you next time.